Okay, real quick before the battery runs out, this would be ratio number three for us. This one is called liquidity ratio. Liquidity, how fast you can turn your assets into cash. Okay, we want to be able to pay our current bills. So, not the Buffalo bills. Good call, I got you. So, what you would do for a liquidity ratio, once again, turning your assets into cash, you would take your current assets, found on the, you got it, take your current liabilities, found on the, yep, you got it, balance sheet, so your current assets, for the example, would equal $86,000 current liabilities would equal 60,000. So if I take that math and divide it, I get a number 1.4. So what that 1.4 means is I have a dollar and 40 cents to cover every dollar of my current liabilities. So I'm able, okay, to sell my current assets and cover my current bills. So it is, when I do the math, 1.4, what the 1.4 does, sorry, I'm in a hurry, the battery's running low, is for every dollar and 40 cents, okay, I'm able to cover my liabilities of a dollar. If this number were up here at, say, $2.50 to every one, this is, this is way too high. You have way too much cash on hand. You should be doing something with your assets, okay, to, to get a better ratio. The closer you can get, maybe, I don't know, 1.2, 1, 1 to 1, you're in good shape. So hopefully that um, helps you. Once again, there's no uh, assignment for this particular one. We're moving into cash flow. Uh, at the next lesson. So hang in there. We're almost done. You got it? Huh?